All right, just taking a look at, uh, well, the disappointing results of my Windmax HY-1000. Uh, just had a little storm uh, move through. Of course, now the wind's not blowing so much, but uh, uh, pretty standard installation here. Having the uh, three leads from the turbine coming into uh, rectifier from uh, Windy Nation. Um, got the output of that going to a standard uh, grid tie inverter. It's got the appropriate dump load installed on that. And I've just got a uh, meter installed just to be able to read the voltage off that. And, uh, and then finally a kilowatt to show the watts going in. And overall the results uh, have been pretty disappointing. I'm just not sure what the issue is. Uh, the Winmax turbines get uh, have a pretty good reputation. I should mention too, I've got a, a Vortex in-speed anemometer hooked up out, and I've just got my phone showing the results of that. Um, and just not getting much power from this thing at all. Um, a little while ago had some gustier winds coming through and uh, you know, there's a little 15 mile an hour gust 13 and I'm barely you can see from the voltmeter there oh, there went the phone not getting much power at all there's a 12 mile an hour wind 11 just not even getting you know 11 or 12 volts consistently and obviously not much on the watts there, 15 watts, 14. I will say that it uh, gets turning pretty nicely in the wind, uh, low wind I should say, but you know, there's a 14 mile an hour gust just getting up to 12 volts. This is the 24 volt uh, HY1000. So just really disappointing, you know, there's 10 miles an hour, 25 watts. So, again, not real sure what the issue is. We can go outside and take a peek. Obviously, I need to get it up a little bit higher. I just wanted to kind of experiment, but uh, there's the vortex there in front. Oh, it churns along pretty well, but just not getting much power output at all. Go back inside here again, take a look. Just got that installed in an old shed for now. Works pretty well. Again, 14, 15 miles an hour. A little over 12.3 volts. Ten miles an hour. And what you can see from the watts there, it's just, just way, way below what the spec should be. I did put a light coat of paint on the whole turbine. Um, I can't imagine that that would be causing any sort of an issue. Just put a light coat of this uh, Rust-Oleum. It's a satin finish so it's definitely not a gloss and maybe that's causing a little bit of resistance and doesn't exactly seem like I'm getting the RPMs I should be but it's hard for me to tell but in terms of the output again just not getting what I should at least in my view there's 15 12 like I say barely struggling to this inverter runs from uh, 10 uh, volts up to 22 so just barely 
cranking out enough volts to uh, get the inverter going and the inverter is going you can see the little indicator lights there on it it's working fine but extremely slow because you're just not getting any juice into it so go outside and take another look here using the phone as a reference slowing it down but uh